Hello and welcome back to the Mock Minute. We uh, decided to have the whole crew on today, so we have the entire staff, but most importantly, we have the one, the only, Coach Brenda Mock, Kirkpatrick. Yes. It's been so long since we did one of these. You forgot my last name. I did. Because no one ever calls me that. Kirkpatrick. I was just going to go with Coach Mock, but I decided to make it a little more formal. You can call you know, me, um, you, know. you can call me Coach Mock or Brenda. Or beautiful. <laughs> I'm gonna stick with that last one. There we go. Beautiful. Beautiful. So well, beautiful. Know, yeah, it's been well. First of all, I've, you know, we wanted to do a better job with this this year, and um, actually, we did film one mock minute that never. That can be in the That's archives. That's in the vault. <laughs> That's in the vault. Yeah, yeah. There's a, a mock minute that we filmed prior to playing High Point in Liberty at home, uh -huh. and we have since been on the road to play High Point in Liberty, yep. Yep. and. Um, but anyway, just we're going to be a little bit more regular with this from now on. Yes, um, you know, when, when we get into the grind of the season, it becomes a little bit more difficult to be consistent with things on the court, as we've seen, and <laughs> off the court. Mm -hmm. um, but we're working towards consistency in the program. Mm -hmm. So you followers, all six of you, do not fear. We will be regular uh, from now on. Yes, we will. We will. So speaking of the grind in the season, mm -hmm. we have two more regular season games coming up. Mm -hmm. Tell me a little bit about those matchups and what you are uh, foreseeing with that. Well, first we have Campbell yes. tomorrow, mm -hmm. tomorrow night at tomorrow. 7, mm -hmm. and uh, that'll be at home. And we haven't played Campbell in quite some time. We played them back in December right after exams. So great team. They're currently fourth in the league. It's going to be a challenge for us. You know, Coach Watkins, actually, who got her 500th victory this year, right. uh, you know, clearly one of the best coaches in the league and in all of women's basketball has done a great job down at Campbell. They're always a challenge. So, um, you know, I don't want to give away any of our special game plans. You know how we are. Yes. Just game plan. Secret. Secret. Um, seriously, it'll, it'll be a tough challenge. And we have Coastal to finish up on Saturday, and that's also senior day. Yes, it is. And, uh, it is. So both both challenges, but we will be at home in our comfort zone. Our girls really want to finish strong, yes. and I anticipate that that's what we will do. Yeah, yeah. And senior day, we have one senior this year, the wonderful April Sickles, and um, you know, very excited about senior day and celebrating her and her career here and everything as well. Definitely. So um, we also a little while back we had our our pink day. And um, which was relatively successful, and uh, we had a lot of events. And just wanted to, you know, talk a little bit about Pink Day and how, you know, what all we did here with that. First of all, let's talk about Janelle's dress. All right, that was this fabulous on top of fabulous Pink Day. Hot pink. Yes. Got lots of, you know, go check it out on Big South Network if you out there and see it. Really, any of our home games, right there. Um, Janelle. Wears a dress. Yep. And, yes. That's uh, that was a goal this year. That's a goal this yeah. year. I, mean, I think I'm going to make it through. Why was that a goal? I don't know. It just came out of nowhere. Trying to do something different. Mm -hmm. Shock the world. Shock well, we're, the world. we're always a little perplexed. I'll, I'll, I'll be, we participate in this of the, the dressing up in men's and women's basketball. Yeah. You know, we're the only sport that feels like we have to have suits. Yes. And it's a it is a fashion contest. It is. We win. Do you, so, you call it that? A fashion contest or a fashion I will go Show with contest. Down or, I'll go with straight up contest. And, um, we win. We get number yeah. one, first place. Well, now on the road, we've, we've gone a little bit more careful. We're we're sharp, 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 though. We're sharp. sharp. Yes. We're trendsetters, although I have not seen any other coaching staff in our league or any, anywhere else wearing their coaching polos on the road. But that's our road gear. Yes, it is. But they're jealous. Road they strong. have commented about they it. They have. Yeah. yeah. They're yeah. jealous. Every coach always is like, uh, it's a great idea. Do you guys do that all for every road game? <laughs> yes. Yes, we yes, do. We do. Yes. They see the Daniel's watching. favorite color is pink. Why don't you talk about the pink game? Oh, the pink game was wonderful. <laughs> um, I got a chance to actually wear my pink outfit instead of wearing a t-shirt. You looked great. I did. I did. Fantastic. I'm also one of the contest winners that we all, that me and Janelle participate in every time. <laughs> every time. And I always look at all the other guys and staff and tell them that their outfits are Sizing them up. up. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Omar participates with that as well. Oh yeah, yeah he Omar does. Omar, Omar straight. He is yes. he is one of the sharpest dressed dress, dress yeah. guys I know. Yeah. The pink game was a real success. We had a fashion show. Mm -hmm. Belk mm -hmm. and Sophie Magazine sponsored a great event. So it wasn't just obviously it was the main purpose was to raise funds for breast cancer research for women in our community. 
which I think was very special. Mm -hmm. uh, went, a lot of our um, funds that we raised went to Mission Hospital, which is obviously a local, a local hospital here. And um, so we do ours just a little bit differently. And uh, it was just a, a fantastic event. And we won the game. Yes. We, had, we beat Longwood. We had yes. a home win. And um, just a great day. Yes, it was great. It was wonderful. It was wonderful. Um, one other thing that this is have, probably not appropriate posture for a for a talk show. I'm just looking how I'm in back. No. You're good. You're good. Okay. You can do what Let you want. It's a mock minute. You can do what you want. Okay. Okay. There you go. So there's this here. Lord, we're worth. Where's the recliner, producer? <laughs> yeah. Get the recliner. We're just gonna get lazy boys out. Put your feet on the desk. The other thing I really did want to talk about really quickly is that we have some. Camps coming up. Camp. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. camp. Yes, we do. And we are very, very excited about camp. We we love camp here. You yeah. know, it's a you know first and foremost, it's a great. We want to grow uh, basketball in the community of Asheville, mm -hmm. so that's why we try to make all of our camps affordable and, and cover costs. Obviously, we want to outreach, and um, you know, we like to run camps to bring prospective student athletes here, high school teams. We have three camps, and if uh, producer Brazelton, if we can get a little close up here. So uh, we're going to kick it off this year with our team camp on the 14th and the 15th. All right. Yeah, so uh, calling all teams nationwide nationwide to come to Asheville. We've got our individual day camp immediately following that. And a little bit later on in the month of June, we're going to close out with our high-intensity camp, which is for rising 8th through 12th graders in high school. And a little bit more intense camp by design. Mm -hmm. I think we wore those kids out last oh, year. Yeah, yeah. They wore them out. Yeah. They were um, but obviously, it it, it's, a, it's a fun time. Yes, it yeah. is. It's Coach Brown's favorite. Yes. Yeah. Lots of fun. The games, talent show. Oh, yeah, talent There's show. The talent camp. show. That's the best. Yeah. That's Learn the best. some basketball. Have some fun doing it. Yeah, that's good. Mm -hmm. And speaking of fun, the most fun, one of the most fun things is coming up next week, and that is the conference. Tournament. Conference yes. tournament. Yes. Myrtle yes. Beach Madness. Yes. I think, I think what we ought to do is film the next mock, mock minute just to give people something to look forward to from Myrtle Beach. Oh, we'll, we'll do yes. that. We'll yeah. Do that. I like it. I like it. Yeah, perhaps on the beach in that, oh, it's going to be a, a blazing 48 degrees next next week. Yes. Uh, oh, yeah. Myrtle Beach Madness down there. Yes. Yes. So this is something we've been talking about for a while. Obviously, we never overlook any opponent, but, you know, getting ready for the tournament and Having a, it's all, the men's and the women's basketball yes. tournament yes. championship will be in Myrtle Beach um, going on at the same time. Mm -hmm. And so that's exciting for the Big South. We're mm -hmm. one of the very few conferences that does it that way. Yeah. It just generates a lot of excitement for basketball in Myrtle Beach. And um, looking forward to that, but one, business to take care of before one that. One step at a time. One step at a time. Tomorrow night, 7 p.m., Kimmel Arena, the Bulldogs take on the Camels. They're the camels. they're the fighting camels. Fighting Did you camels. say that? On the fighting they are the camels. fighting camels. Spinning camels. Not the not the passive not camels. No. As opposed to the passive walking through the desert right. slowly yeah. camels. Right. Yeah. Well, whatever kind of camel they are, we're coming at them with everything we have. With everything we have. Everything it'll, we have. it'll take everything we have yep. Yep. to yep. challenge them. Yep. They're a very good team. Very good. But um, I think it'll be a great game. Yes. Two good teams will. squaring off. Well, thank you, everyone, and we look forward to filming the Bob Mock Minute in on the, the beach. beach. On the beach. On the beach. Get your swimsuits out. Yes. 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 See you guys next week. Bye. Bye.